welcome to Willamette Valley Couponing. And I got this great, amazing money-making haul. It is an $8.39 moneymaker. I did it with, I got things from Ibotta, Swagbucks, and MyPoints. And I know I've talked about Swagbucks and MyPoints before. It's just been a little while. I think the last time I did it was back in January, February, beginning of the year. And it was with those, the Kiwi polishes. Um, so it's been a while since I talked about them. And this morning I couldn't sleep. I woke up around 3.34 and I decided to look on Swagbucks. It's been a couple weeks. I usually do it at the beginning of the month because that's where I like to print coupons. You get points for printing on, um, printing your coupons from coupons.com there. And then also on my points as well. So it's been a few weeks since I've actually um, looked on there and I saw an armor all deal and about Christmas time we did an armor all deal with swag bucks and my points as well so super excited to see it back and it's perfect timing for Father's Day it's a great money maker you got to spend a little out of pocket but it um, it's definitely worth it so uh, also I bought it had a weekend warrior bonus and I needed eight items to get a three dollar um, bonus and it just depends because on my mom's account, she needed eight items to get a $2 bonus. And it's super frustrating when all the bonuses aren't the same. I know um, I've experienced myself. So hopefully you guys got a good like $3 bonus that needed a low, um, low amount of offers because it would be, this will be a really good deal. The first um, like seven items I got was, are definitely repeats that I've been doing in the last week and a half but I'm okay because they're pretty cheap ones. And the main star of the event uh, tonight is the armor all. So I just need those things, uh, some filler items to get that weekend warrior bonus. And I definitely wanted to get it out today because this weekend I'm going camping. But let's get to the haul. I did this Sour Punch Bites again. So these are dollar out of pocket. I bought is giving you back 55 cents making them just 45 cents and earlier in the week I had a 25 cent any candy item or any bagged candy or something like that which made it cheaper so check your any items and see if you got anything like that to make this a super low price but today um, it's just cost me 45 cents for this then I did the Gatorade chews these are also a dollar out of pocket I bought is giving you back a 50 cent rebate, making them just 50 cents. I, I found the secret body cleansing wipes. I only got one box a couple, uh, like a week ago, and I really wanted to get another box. I haven't actually tried it yet, but I feel excited about it. I want it, uh, especially with summer coming and the heat and stuff. So this is $2.97. You paid that out of pocket. I bought it's giving you back $2, making it just $0.97. Cents. And I'm excited to actually try this. Did the Rubbermaid Ice Tray again. This is $1.97. There were coupons um, in a insert. My mind just went blank on what I think was smart So It was a dollar. It would have made it a three cent money maker. I don't have any of those coupons left, but if you guys do, definitely go for it. So this is $1.97. I paid that out of pocket. I got back a dollar, making it just 97 cents. And the other day, my mom um, looked at my stockpile and my um, ice trays, and she's like, what are you gonna do with all those ice trays? And I, I bought us like just keeps resetting it. Normally they only reset a few times, like five times, but Pretty sure I've done this more than five times. I did the Oral B toothbrush. This was a dollar ninety-seven out of pocket. I bought it, gave me back a dollar, making it just ninety-seven cents. I did red vines. Red vines is always a favorite in this house. Can't go wrong with them. These are $1.24, I paid that out of pocket. I bought it, giving me back 45 cents, making it just 79 cents. I did the Stony Field uh, yogurt snack packs. These are $1.24, no. These are $1.74. 
I bought is giving you back 75 cents for it, making it just 72 cents. All right, on to the main event. Armor All Total Vehicle Detailer. This is a buy for scenario. They are priced at $6.88 each. So I paid $27.52 out of pocket. So yes, it is high, but it pays off. So $27.52 for four of these. You gotta buy four for this to work. I bought it has $2 back for each one. It's a limit of five. I got four, so I got $8 back from my bada. Swag Bucks has 1,500 points when you buy four, so that is $15 back when you buy four. My points is giving you back 2,500, and their point system's a little different. I'm pretty, I think what it is is 175 points equals out to a dollar, give or take about that. So it comes out to $14.28, and if I'm wrong, I'm pretty sure it's something like that there it's a little different and I always struggle and I can't ever find like the real answer but I like try to do some math and I'm pretty sure it's 175 points equals a dollar um so 1428 so it makes it a nine dollar and 76 cent money maker to buy all four of these you paid the 2752 you got back from my bada swag bucks my points making it a $9.76 money maker. Right, perfect timing for Father's Day. I paid $39.14 out of pocket. I bought a giving back $14.45. $0.20 of that, I'm pretty sure was a any receipt item. I hit my level up two, so that's a dollar. I got the Weekend Warrior bonus, which was $3.00. Swag bucks give me back $15. My points give me back $14.28, making all my rebates $47.53. So if you take my out of pocket price, which was $39.14, and my uh, rebates back $47.53, makes this an $8.39 money maker. I'm really happy with that. It just, I love it. I love when I could do swag. Um, swag bucks and my points it's been like I said since like the new year since I was able to do it I also submitted my receipt to fetch rewards I did get points back it just wasn't like I didn't hit any special bonuses so I got like 50 points because any receipt you submit to them you get points and it builds up so I submit every receipt to fetch rewards and I use it I use the points to get like gift cards same with swag bucks and my points it's similar, you re submit your receipt and you could either s check out with like PayPal, there might be like Venmo, I'm not too sure, I use PayPal. Um, and they also have like hundreds of different gift cards and things. So if you haven't got those apps yet, I definitely recommend it. And the, it took me, I heard a few people when I first started couponing, I heard people talk about swag bugs, my points. I even heard them talk about Checkout 51 and Saving Star and I was really hesitant to download them. I was like, I don't know, I bought as good. I'm getting good deals. Until I learned you could like stack things all together and get like amazing good money making deals. Like it was probably a month and a half or two months before um, I started. I think I started with Checkout 51 and then went to Saving Star, then Fetch, Swag, My Points. I mean, there's so many different, there's um, Kick, Shop Kick. I haven't done that one yet. Um, I done I downloaded the hog something hog when I first started and I didn't under quite understand it so I never went back to it but I think I'm going to check that out because there's so many different places that you could just stack these rebates up with each other and just making these great money-making deals if you don't know where to go you can look at my description box and I have a link to all of them there this weekend I'm going camping I don't know if it's camping when you stay in a yurt. I've never stayed in a yurt. I'm super excited. We're going to go stay. My sister and I are going to go get a yurt at the coast. And it'll be our first time ever staying in a yurt. So I'm super excited about that. And that's why I'm doing this haul and this video today, Thursday. 
so you guys could have that um, have a chance to watch it and work on your weekend warrior bonus as well but I'll be gone over the weekend so no shopping for me I might I know that there's a Walmart somewhere along the coast I might try to find um, some deals or I know there's a Walgreens for sure but that is my haul for this weekend and I will see you guys later in the week and I really hope you guys have an excellent weekend and you guys get these good deals and I hope you're able to do the money maker as well.